y'all, it's Gigi Perfect Face here, and today I'm going to be talking about the very much highly anticipated Synthetica right now, Sensational, and her name is Glenna, and this is what she's giving right now. She's in Balayage Platinum. We're we going to get this look another redo, because y'all know with the Vice unit on my channel from Sensational, I did not like how the wig was made. It was just, I hated the texture of it. It had like an Easter egg type of feel. This quality of this one is better, of course, because they usually put more um, money into the wet lace collection. So yeah, this is what she looking like. I just wanted to show you guys the parting space. She's supposed to be a 13 by six. I'm gonna let y'all be the judge of that. This is the parting space and stuff. And this is what she looking like. I just wanted to show you guys the, um, the inside and now I'm just about to pop this on. I'm not sure if I'm gonna install it on camera or not. Probably just gonna come back and do some edges. I'm not sure. I don't know if y'all like for me to install them on camera. Process. I don't know if y'all just like the the talking review or like. next time this got to be and use this to install because I, I don't know where my glue is. I really wanted to glue this week, but I'm gonna have to just Y'all, this is the natural plucked hairline that it's supposed to be. Um, this is what it came like. I, this is what it looks like. This is the hairline. Um, yeah, definitely not as pre-plucked as these wigs usually come. I guess so. And I'm mad I can't find my um, tweezers. So I have to go in with these and try to make it plucked because I can't deal with this. Like, what is this? This is the wig. Now I'm just about to go and take some of my adhesive right now and definitely go and make some edges and flatten her down. She did not come pre-plucked, so that is a complete lie. As far as the balayage platinum color, this is not a pre-plucked wig. Hey y'all, it's Gigi Perfect Face here, and today I'm going to be reviewing Wet Lace 13 by 6 wig, and her name is Glenna, and this is what she's giving right now. She's in balayage platinum. I did the edges and tried to do... A little dramatic look now as far as these edges i didn't really intend on going for that look i noticed when i curl my edges or my potential baby hairs up i don't like how they look i like it better like when i curl them down because i curl the sides edges down and they just came out so much better and these they didn't really come out how i wanted them to so i had to just work around it and deal with it but yeah y'all this is what she's giving this is the length of it. I'm going to show you guys the back of the wig and how it's looking. I'm not sure how it's looking. I'm just going to show y'all um, a 360 of the wig while it's on my head. So, yeah. So as far as the texture of this wig, I feel like it's a little yakky, but not too yakky. I do feel like I'm not receiving a lot of shading or none of that like type of stuff. Now, as far as the texture of this wig, I feel like it's a light yakky, like not too yakky, not too silky, I guess. So it's right in between. It doesn't feel like the Vice unit, which was like in the same color. It's on my channel. Ugh, I absolutely hated that wig. It felt like Easter egg grass like i hated it like i hate how it felt like i could have fixed the edges and stuff i just hate how the wig felt but anyway i'm glad they put this color with the with their frontal collections because i do love how this looks they also have it in balayage caramel balayage chocolate balayage gold balayage mocha light ash brown 2627 613 i feel like that would have been really pretty 613 so yeah, these are all the colors that they have them in. As far as the the hairline on this wig was absolutely god awful. Like I don't know what the the whole thing. I feel like that's the whole point of the sensational wet lace collection is for it to have the little blended out pre plucked hairline. But this wig, this specific color, did not come pre plucked. I absolutely hated it, and I still hate the hairline actually. Um, I try to go in and pluck it a little bit. I feel like this could be plucked. It just, it wasn't giving me pre-plucks like the wet lace usually is. So as far as this specific wig that I'm wearing right now, these how the curls look. They have a little layer effect. It's like a natural length. I guess you can say this wig is like 26 inches. 
It's definitely not 28. It's definitely like 26 inches. I'm not, I'm not sure. They, Sensational is still not stating the length of their wigs. I noticed that most companies do them now, so I want Sensational to start doing that. And you know, since we're in a more up-to-date time and start listing the length of their wigs, I would really love that so I can give you guys an exact amount. Sensational wigs can be tricky. As far as this wig being 60, mm, it could have been dropped down to like 50. I think I paid 64 for this wig, if I'm not mistaken. She's a little too pricey, bro. I mean, for this not to be a human blend, I, I guess I honestly, would I pay 60 for this wig again? Probably not. I think it was like 64 because I had to pay for shipping and stuff, but. I wish she was a little lower, like in the 50s range, cause 60 is pushing it. Like she cute, but she, she ain't all that to me. But I like her, y'all. I do like this wig. I like it more than the other wig that I had that was in this color. For sure, that's a definitely, yeah. I definitely like this wig more than the one I had from the Vice Unit collection. Would I pay 60 for her again? Um, I don't think I will go by this same color again in this wig, but she's cute. But I just feel like the parting, the wig just wasn't really giving me pre plug So that is such a just complete con for me. So with that being said, I'm going to rate this wig a C because the hairline was just horrible. Like, oh my God, it was so dense, y'all. It was just so, if you don't want to put the work in and go and pluck the wig, this wouldn't be a wig that I recommend you get as far as this specific color that I'm wearing right now. The one that I was sent was just not pre-plugged and I'm not happy about that. I still hate the hairline and I just didn't really have too much time to sit up plucking the wig. So yeah, I have more wig reviews to review and I'm just so excited for more content to be filming. And yeah, yeah, I'll see y'all in my next video.